Hi there, George Bruno, also known to many as the Sultan of Silver. And this is your mid-year comfort zone talk. This circle right here, that circle represents your comfort zone. That's your comfort zone right there. Let me just move this properly. There we go. I want you to see this. Inside this circle is everything that you currently eat, read, your relationship, or relationships are in there. Uh, easily attainable goals. I'll just do E, A, G. Okay? And this is a circle that we kind of put around ourselves. Okay? And we like hovering right around here in the middle. In the middle. For instance, when we go to a party or a networking event and somebody asks us a challenging question, that question takes us from the middle of our comfort zone towards the edge of the comfort zone. The people, if you're a single person, the people that you usually ask out, the people that you usually date, usually exist right about here. Why? Because if you chose anyone different, that means you have to go close to the edge. I would contend that your blood pressure and your anxiety level increases the closer you get to here. That's pushing the limit. Those that are into high intensity interval training, any kind of cross training, you've pushed those limits. Okay. This also would be called playing it safe. Everything that you want in life, wherever you are, if you're in America or anywhere in the world, exists out here. But what that does is that means you have to come close to the edge of your comfort level and break through the comfort level. You want more income? Let's just put an arrow up. Arrow up. Income. You want a different partner or a mate? Someone who has better habits? Someone who's healthier? Someone that's good for you? I'll just put companion right here. Did you want a different vehicle? Do you want to lose 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 100 pounds? Is weight an issue? I'll just put weight loss, WL, there. Do you want to enter a new career? Are you tired of what you're doing? Are you working in retail? Are you working in a damn mall somewhere? and you want to break free, and you haven't been able to do that, let's just call that freedom. Career freedom. All of these things that you want exist outside this circle. But we like to pitch our tent right in the middle here, and we get a little bit nervous the closer to the edge of our comfort zone. And what happens is the minute that we start to go out, we break through a little bit, you run into a little trouble, you do a U-turn, and you run right back to the comfort zone. The same old people, the same old habits, the same old things. So let me contend with you on this one thing. 
just about everything that you want out of life that will improve your life, your quality of your life, the quality of your children's lives. If you don't have children, your future children, your pets' lives if you don't have kids, or you, if you have parents that are aging like I do. I have three children and two aging parents. Everything I want for my family and for my life exists outside of my circle. So I'm constantly getting rid of the U-turns. So this is what you do. Little by you can break through and then you're just like in a free fall and you don't know what to do and you panic and then you end up doing that U-turn thing and coming back. Let's not do that. When you make your circle bigger, it's easier to get to the things that you were made to be and made to do. Every time you say no to a networking event or a business idea, or you don't want to grow, or you don't want to go to the gym, or you eat a whole pizza like I used to do. I used to love those Papa John's where they bring two pizzas and wings and garlic knots, and I would eat a whole pizza and three beers. And no wonder I was 260 pounds. I don't do that. haven't done that in years. But every time you do that, you're shrinking your circle. And there are some people whose circles are this big. And yet, you want to be with people who have the bigger circles. Because they're getting closer. Because everything you want exists outside of your comfort zone. So big circle people need to network, hang out, email, talk to, associate with other big circle people, unless the smaller circle people are interested in a bigger circle, in a bigger comfort zone. Why in the world, why in the world would you want to be with people or have activities that are consistent with the small circle world and the tiny little comfort zone. Expand this circle and this stuff here becomes easier. It's not so far off in the future. It's not so unattainable looking. You can do it. I know you can because I believe in you. And let me put it this way. If I can do it, Anyone can do it. So go out and do it. Mm. Where do you want to be this time next year? Describe it. Every detail. Everything you see, hear, and smell. I offer five traction sessions. If you're interested in being in a different place this time next year. Now everyone's, all the coaches out there. 30 days to a new you, 90 days to a new you, I know better than that. It's going to take some time, just like it took time for you to get where you're at now. Let's focus on this time next year. If you want to know more, I offer a free 15-minute consultation. Email me, gb at georgebruno.com and I'll tell you all about my five traction sessions, and then we can decide if it's something that's right for you. Thanks.